Nowadays, as a part of the educational process, students work at a company for a short period of time without pay. Do the advantages of this outweigh the disadvantages? Students work at a company for a shorter period of time without pay. This is called unpaid internships. Working without pay in any company for a shorter period of time is called unpaid internships. So this essay is about this topic like uh, internship. So you can use these words, uh, topic related vocabulary words in your essay like unpaid internships, internship, former internship and educational process. You can use uh, these topic related vocabulary words, degree programs, part of course, educational institutes. So now look at the introduction. Unpaid internships are a part of many degree programs nowadays. I believe the advantages of this trend fairly outweigh the disadvantages. So now we are discussing the advantages of unpaid internships. The main advantage of working in companies for free as part of the course is to students themselves. For free here it was without pay unpaid and free these are synonyms you can say without pay unpaid and for free students gain valuable experience which can help them in deciding the career of their choice this is a complex sentence comma and which students gain valuable experience this is a simple sentence from here to here students gain valuable experience and now comma and the other sentence uh, these two sen simple sentences are joined with this word which which can help them in deciding the career of their choice so this is a complex sentence your essay should be a mixture of Complex sentences, compound sentences, conditional sentences, and simple sentences in order to get good bands. An internship can also give them the possibility of securing a job upon graduation or shortly thereafter. So, internship helps students to gain job right after their education so former interns have a competitive advantage over the job seekers since the company knows them these internships also benefit the employers in several ways these benefits uh, are for the students who are doing work there and now the advantages for the em employers they get services at no cost they can screen trainees and get acquainted with their quality of work. They can also hire employees who show good prog progress when performing duties assigned by them. This is also a complex sentence. In this way, employers can convert interns to full-time employees seamlessly, which reduces or eliminate any training-related cost, which comma this is also a complex sentence okay there are benefits to the educational institutes also these advantages were for employers or you can say students here in this body paragraph benefits for the employ sorry employers employees and here these benefits are for employers and now educational institutes their uh, student interns tend to bring their real world experience back to the classroom which helps keep courses relevant and curriculum up to date with the current trends this is also a complex sentence this results in a richer learning experience for everyone. These three body paragraphs were about 
the advantages now we are discussing the other point on the other hand unpaid internships also have some downside those who do unpaid internships can be exploited and made to work longer hours which may affect the current employees this is also a complex sentence they may find these younger counterparts a threat secondly this was the first point now second point many students can't afford to take an internship if it does not pay anything this is a conditional sentence if conditional which can contribute to the social inequality and now the third point finally it has been seen that doing a free internship does not actually increase employability employers start thinking that if they such unpaid interns may also be willing to work for lesser money than their regular employees this is a conditional sentence to sum up unpaid internships have advantages to interns employers and educational institutes there are few disadvantages but the advantages overpower them advantages to interns employers and educational institutes advantages to interns advantages to employers and advantages to educational institutes see how beautifully the conclusion has been written internships unpaid internships had advantages to interns employers and educational institutes three body paragraphs 1 2 and 3 and there are fewer disadvantages these are fewer disadvantages so in conclusion it is uh, conclusion is written in a way that it is the uh, it, it, it looks like that uh, what we have written in our body paragraphs and like look at this advantages to interns employers and educational institutes and the, the fourth body paragraph there are fewer disadvantages and now our opinion but then what did is overpowered them